I consistently have great deliverability in my email campaigns and that has resulted in more than 5% reply rate, booking me dozens of sales calls. But ensuring top deliverability can take a ton of work unless you use tools to help you do that. That's why today I want to explain how Email Guard works, how it can help you increase or maintain peak deliverability and how their domain masking proxy is changing the cold email game. Now if you don't have great deliverability you're bound to fail. I'll be honest, you won't make it with cold email unless you use 9 tools by Email Guard that help you follow the best email sending practices. You might have heard of some of these tools, so just look through the chapters in the video and check what's new to you. But I'm sure that you haven't heard of the tool that I'll share in the end, the Domain Masking Proxy. So first, let me explain all the other tools. First we have Blacklist Monitoring. What this tool does is monitor your domain and IP addresses to ensure that they're not in any of the major blacklists. But and if you are, Email Guard will notify you ASAP and help you get out of them. You see, blacklists are very important because all email service providers like Gmail and Outlook use blacklists to determine whether or not your email is worthy to be delivered. For example, if you're listed in Spam House, one of the biggest blacklists, your email is likely to get redirected to spam every time you try to reach out to Gmail mailboxes. That's why it's very important to ensure that you're not in any of the blacklists. Now let's say you are in one. Email Guard will then notify you and it will also guide you through getting out of the blacklist and it will also recover your sender's reputation. Once that's done, you'll get notified again and can continue blasting cold emails. Just don't do whatever got you into the blacklist in the first place. Second tool is contact verification. As you know, if you reach out to invalid mailboxes or spam traps, you're going to hurt your mailbox and domain reputation and that will result in poor deliverability. Because of that, you can use the contact verification feature to verify each email address before reaching out to them. And if the email is valid, you can safely reach out to it. Otherwise, you should avoid sending emails to any other invalid or catch-all mailboxes. This will keep your bounce rate low, reduce spam complaints, and ensure you look like a good guy. Because you are, right? Third tool is DMARC monitoring. In plain English terms, DMARC is a record in your domain that secures email sending. It's a safety feature against phishing and spoofing attacks. Basically other people using your email to reach out to someone and do bad things. This tool will help you monitor DMARC data, see any errors or other insights in user-friendly format. If all of this sounds like gibberish, don't worry. You don't need to become a programmer to edit DNS records. Just monitor the activity and follow AI recommendations. That's it. Fourth tool is email authentication. This tool allows you to look up and generate DNS records for your domains. Just like the previous thing, DMARC, this might also sound difficult to you. But don't worry, all domains need SPF, DKM and DMARC records to work with top tier deliverability. This tool will automatically generate those records for you so you can relax without the need to learn about domains and spend hours troubleshooting. Or you can use InfraForge and MailForge and this setup will be automatic. But more on that later. Fifth tool is Email Tester. This tool allows you to send a test email to see whether or not it can go through spam filters and land in the primary inbox. Basically, you have your email copy, you send it to a dedicated mailbox, and then your email will be scored based on 162 different data points. Once that's done, AI will analyze your email copy to find any issues. Lastly, you'll get actionable steps to improve your email so you could enjoy higher deliverability. Pretty simple, but crucial for everyone. Great extra safety feature. Sixth tool, hosted redirects. As you may know, you should never use your primary domain to send out cold emails. That's why we have secondary domains and we use them to create extra mailboxes. The problem with that is, if anyone visits your secondary domain, they won't see anything. That's why you need domain redirecting. This way, if you have, let's say, two domains, primary domain Salesforce and secondary domain trysalesforce.com, and if you're sending emails with the 
second domain, if anyone visits trysalesforce.com, they'll end up on salesforce.ai, on your primary website, because that's what you want. This increases trust and of course conversions. So this tool will allow you to do that with ease. Not only that, it will host everything on clean IPs to avoid blacklists and it will even add SSL certificates to make it even safer. I know I said a lot of different weird acronyms during this video, but you don't need to know what they mean. As long as they're there, that's good. Seventh tool is mailbox placement tests. This tool allows you to check where your emails land across different email service providers. For example, I recently released videos about Gmail and Outlook changes that may affect cold emailers. I shared what to do to make sure you won't get destroyed, but you'll only know for sure once you test it. So this tool allows you to reach out to Gmail, Outlook, or other ESPs and see if you reach the primary inbox or the spam folder. This matters a ton because different ESPs ESPs have different rules, so while you have great deliverability with Gmail, you might have terrible results with Outlook. And one last tool before I talk about the most important one is the spam checker. I've shared a couple of spam checker tools in the past, one by Mail Meteor, one by Salesforce, and this one isn't any different. Email Guard Spam Checker analyzes your email content to give you a spam score. If you have any spam triggers, attachments, or anything sketchy in your email, of course the spam score will be higher. And the higher the score, the more chance you have of landing in spam. This spam checker will also showcase all the commonly used spam words in your your email and remove them for you to avoid spam filters, saving you from the trip to the spam folder. The combination of this will increase your deliverability. Now, the tool you all been waiting for, the domain masking proxy. Remember the hosted redirects tool I mentioned previously? The tool that redirects anyone visiting your secondary domain and pushes them to your primary domain? Well, that thing has a problem. You see, if Gmail or other service providers see that all you do is redirect, they might not like it. And that will of course damage your deliverability. That's where domain masking comes in. When you use a domain masking tool, instead of your secondary domains redirecting traffic to primary domains, they become like your primary domains. Meaning that all of your secondary domains will load up the same website that your primary domain has. No more redirections, no more sending traffic to a different site. Everything is happening at one place. All users see the same thing and all email service providers are happy. And you're happy too because your deliverability is top tier. Okay, you heard all the great things. You now may be wondering what's the pricing and are there any alternatives? Well, first let me share the pricing. Instead of yapping, let me just share the plans on the screen so you could stop the video and take a look for yourself. And as promised, here are a few alternatives. For email masking, you can use MailForge or InfraForge. I mentioned those tools earlier. Both of these tools allow you to set up domains and mailboxes in minutes, automating any DNS record setup, redirecting, or even domain and mailbox name creation. Basically, it's email infrastructure done in minutes. Now, if this isn't enough for you, I also suggest taking a peep at WarmForge. WarmForge is an email warm-up tool that also includes domain health monitoring and blacklist checkups basically everything to maintain your deliverability. And if that's not enough, my last suggestion is to take a look at Salesforge, a tool that can personalize cold emails for you automatically, validate email addresses, and even help you reply with AI. Now there's only so much I can say in an outro. So instead, I suggest you take a look at these videos if you want to learn more about Salesforge tools. Subscribe, 